How to change and replace background without subject cutout in Photoshop. Welcome to PS Desire YouTube channel. Our channel is about Photoshop and photography tutorials. In this episode, I will show you how to change and replace background without cutting subject and also how to match foreground and background colors to make scene looks natural. First open images for back foreground and background. In here, lady image is using for foreground subject and room interior for background. Place background above the subject. Here I use blending technique to get perfect masking. Change blending to multiply. You can see both foreground and background blend well to see through. I'm just moving subject to place it in good position. Now duplicate subject woman layer and drag above the background. Due to multiply blending mode, we see some dark tint appeared on image. I will use levels adjustment layer and increase whites to make it normal. Now dark tint disappeared. Take a magic wand tool and make selection. Just click on plain color to select. Add layer mask. It need to be invert. So go to adjustments and select invert. Control plus I keyboard shortcut. Hold Alt and click on mask to see the alpha mask and any blank spaces fill or paint with white. If I zoom into the hair, we can see lots of whites and grays appearing on edges of hair. Take soft brush and keep foreground color black and paint on hair. Lot of people find difficult masking hair. You can see how easy it is. You can use this technique to replace background. Even small thin hair stands also appearing well. We don't miss even single hair with this trick. Now we successfully mask foreground and add it to back background. Finally, I want to match the background and foreground colors to give you a feel that it is all natural photograph. Duplicate the background layer and drag on to top of all layers. Keep blending normal and add clipping mask. Any changes visible to foreground subject only. Now go to filters and select blur and apply average. Change blending to soft light. Here is before and after. This technique works perfectly for brighter foreground and background images. You don't need to worry about hair. It is easiest method to mask hair properly. And finally I want to add some nice bokeh effect to background 
with lens blur filter. Go to channels and create a new layer. And take gradient tool with black and white colors. Just simply drag from top to bottom to make a depth map. Go to filters and select lens blur. Keep depth map alpha 1 and adjust focal distance and radius. Then click OK. Here is final image. Thanks for watching. Keep visit our channel for more video tutorials. Please subscribe, post a comment, click thumbs up, like and share videos with your friends. See you again in next tutorial.